This is your one and only FireSpark81 with your daily dose of video goodness and today I'm going to show you how to quickly and easily infinitely reset your nightmare dungeons in Diablo 4. Let's get to it. So the first thing you want to do is use a sigil and locate the dungeon that it enchanted. Go to said dungeon. Do as much of that dungeon as you want to do. Just don't complete it. Once you are done doing as much of the dungeon that you want to do, all you need to do is exit the dungeon. Once you have exited the dungeon, teleport to any town as long as it is a decent distance away from said dungeon. I think what is happening here is that the dungeon is unloading and that's what creates this bug. Once you are out of the loading screen and into the town, set a timer for exactly two minutes. Now just wait. After your two minutes is up, go back to your dungeon. Once you have re-entered the dungeon, you will realize that this dungeon has been reset. Now anytime you want to reset this dungeon going forward, all you have to do is exit the dungeon. As you can see in the video on the screen, I exit the dungeon, the dungeon's reset. There is no need to go back to town, wait two minutes, do anything like that. Once you have done the initial setup, your dungeon will infinitely reset every time you exit it. Few disclaimers here. Do note that this could be considered an exploit. It's possible this could get your account banned. They may or may not care. I highly suspect pretty much everybody is going to be doing this and I really doubt they're going to be banning thousands of people but they may so who knows so do this at your own risk but this can be absolutely insane because there are a lot of different things that you can get on your nightmare dungeon enchants specifically increased loot drops this will work with any nightmare dungeon so if you just want to grind experience I highly advise finding one that is quick and easy to grind experience on and enchanting that one you're gonna see a a lot of other videos out there that are copy and paste because nobody bothers to do any testing and they all just report on the same news without verifying anything unlike me who verified that you don't actually need to go to a bunch of other nonsense in another dungeon like you're gonna see a bunch of videos about you simply just got to go back to town and wait two minutes so if you want plenty of other Diablo content that's actually been tested make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you can be notified when I upload other Diablo 4 videos all right and that is it for this video hope Hopefully you found it helpful and informational. I want to give an absolute massive shout out and thank you to all of my channel supporters for helping to keep these videos a sponsor free. You all are absolutely amazing people. If you would like to become an official channel supporter, check out the links in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. If you're shy, you don't like to comment, just hit that thumbs up button and share your support. Until next time, thanks for watching.